<laughs> okay, it's Tuesday, the 19th of December 2023, and Harmon just got a card from his Uncle Sid. And it's a very nice card. Now it says happy holiday. Now Dennis Prager always says which holiday are you referring to? So Harmon yeah. Let's go. Harmon's gonna read the card. Oh my we don't have time. Yeah, we'll look at them later. Too many. He got a lot of Christmas cards. He got one from Mike and a lot of people. He got from who you get them from? My mother, Duda, and you, Mike. And I gave you one. Yeah, that's the time. Okay, ready? And then Uncle said, making yeah. that six cards. Okay, let's go. We're going to do math today. Man, that's a lot. That's the math that we're working on this week. Alright, you need light. Okay. Okay. Now this is a challenge to read. Uncle Sid writes like a doctor. <laughs> doctor Uncle Sid. Let's go. Read, 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 read. Okay, here goes nothing. Alright. Dear Harmon. Har Harmon. That's not my name. Harmon. I know. I forgot to say the R. Dear Harmon. Thanks so very much for the Hanukkah greeting card. The, the meaning of the holiday is actually pretty simple. Light may be provided in sometimes miraculous ways when, it's, when it is needed. I am very impressed at your typing and your knowledge of history and music, especially English composers such as Edward Elgar. Please try hearing a few pieces by Ralph Vaughn Williams, who most people would have considered have written many very beautiful pieces, more so than Elgar. <clears throat> I hope you will put that miniature book to good use, perhaps for very small writings by you, or very or very small stamps. I will try to send more stamps from Bren if you like. I would love to come visit you and your daddy in Arizona. Please keep up the good work as a student and as a very good son. I know you will. Santa will be good to you as always this Christmas. Please enjoy a good Christmas. What? Why? When I say I mean, please enjoy good Christmas music such as the Nutcracker. Much love, and much love in regards from Uncle Sid to you and your daddy. Okay, who wrote the Nutcracker? Tchaikovsky. And who's the best version? Do you like? Oh. Uh, we listened to two versions. What? Carrion? Did you? No, do we didn't do Carrion. Who are the Ormandy and who? Ormandy was well, the Eugene Ormandy did the abridged version. I know. And who was the other? Who did the whole version? He did the, the same some, the same conductor who was knighted by the Queen of England, and he uh, did Porgy and Bess, the best version. Oh, I ever Rattle, heard. Simon Rattle. Sir Simon Rattle, yes. <coughs> I didn't know he was knighted. Yeah. He's one of my favorite conductors. Who's your favorite one, conductor? The only one I know who's nice is Paul McCartney and Ringo yeah. Starr. No, there's Sir Yehudi Menuhin, uh, Sir Edward Elgar, 
He was knighted? Yes. He was a British subject. Many, 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 many more. Okay. Well, uh, I, I how about add, um? Add it to my collection. Okay. Now, are uh, whose version do you like better, Ormandy's or Rattles? Ormandy. Because why? The British version has all the good parts. Simon yeah. Rattle does the boring ex dances, uh, all those stuff, etc. Really now. Hey! This one's way easier to read. Dear Harmon and Voltralta, I can't wait until I see you again when we go on vacation. Thank you. Wait. Thank you for the wonderful Christmas card and letter you. Alright, you are such a good card writer. Have a very Merry Christmas. Me and Duda are going to see Godzilla. What she's referring to is God's own minus one, the movie. This Wednesday, this Wednesday. Wish you were going with us. See you soon. All right. Uh, here's an here's another one. Just for it's, this is for me, not Voltralta too. Voltralta, yeah. I hope you get everything you want for Christmas. You're such a good boy. I'm sure Santa will be good to you. Love always your aunt Linda. Now, why is it that everyone says Santa will be good to you? Santa will be good to you. I who who are we gonna write the a card to next? Jim. Jim, right? From DadsWorksheets.com. Yeah, that's a, a very very important website, and you're trying to sign up. Okay, let's get ready to uh, do our farmertized vocabulary. Then we got to do our math. First, let me put these here and then put them back where I got. I, I put them on the little ledges. Oh, also, I need a second stocking because I was. Oh, here's Doodah's. Doodah's card. That's a nice card. Hey, hamster. Hamster guy. card. My hamster's a scatter rod. All right, we're going to do our next, our next I got lesson. A lot of money this What's an, what's an alderman? Oh, wait one second. Right. Alderman. Wait, hold on a second. Hold the phone. We don't have much time. Okay. You could tell me. Can't you do two things at once? Here's my turn. All right. Aldermans are what? What's an alderman? That's an important person oh, in, in a city. Like a, like a member of a city council or something, okay? Oh. What's ambidextrous? What? Ambidextrous. What is Ambidextrous. Yeah. Right here. Ambidextrous. Yeah. I forget that. Oh, I don't know how I forget these words. Okay, we had one president who was oh, ambidextrous. Who was ambidextrous? Ambidextrous. What president? Huh. What president? Garfield. Oh, he writes with both hands. He wrote with both hands. He wrote Latin with uh, his right. <laughs> what's an amphitheater? What's an amp What's an amphitheater? Amphitheater? You walked across one last night coming back from Santa Claus. You know those steps? It's like a, a it's like a stage and a, and outdoors, like an outdoor concert. Oh, it's an amphitheater. Oh, okay, that's it. A <laughs> All spider right, we're going to do that. Some venomous spider, like a brown... What's a congregation? I don't know, but some venomous spider tried to jump on my leg. What's, a, what's a congregation? Congregation, like a meeting? Congregation is like members of a church. Oh, <laughs> oh. Who is Confucius? Confucius, some um, Chinese Chinese person. Philosopher. Philo oh, philosopher. Philosopher. What's a dinghy? Some small boat. Give me another word for a dinghy. Kind of like a sm uh, like a little small speedboat. A skiff. A skiff. Yeah. Oh. Okay. All right. Oh. Somebody's trying to call me. He won't be up. I was right. Thank you. Yeah, all right. Well, that's all for now. Hey, look at it. So I learned about roaches. I learned about kids jumping on my lap.